In today's military aviation, the F-35 Lightning II and the J-20 Mighty Dragon stand as the apex predators, representing the cutting edge of aerial warfare technology. These fifth-generation stealth fighters are more than just warplanes, they're flying supercomputers, built for information dominance and networked warfare, capable of processing vast amounts of data in real time. The F-35 and J-20 are the signature jets of the US and China, symbolizing a high-stakes technological and geopolitical rivalry that is shaping the future of global security. Their impact goes far beyond dogfights. They gather intelligence, target threats, and act as command hubs for entire networks of forces, integrating seamlessly with other military assets. Designed to penetrate contested airspace and neutralize advanced defenses, these jets are reshaping global military strategy and redefining what it means to control the skies. Their development has consumed vast resources from research and engineering to massive defense budgets, reflecting their central role in future conflicts and the immense stakes involved. As their numbers grow and deployment expands, they're changing the strategic calculus for military planners worldwide, forcing nations to rethink their own air defense and offensive capabilities. This video will compare their origins, design philosophies, and battlefield roles, exploring how each jet reflects the priorities and ambitions of its nation. We'll break down their stealth, avionics, and the strategic implications of their deployment, revealing what sets these aircraft apart from all others. The F-35 and J-20 aren't just aircraft, they're competing visions for the future of air power, each pushing the boundaries of what's possible in aerial combat and defense. As both nations refine these jets and adapt their strategies, the balance of power in regions like the Indo-Pacific hangs in the balance, making the skies more contested than ever before. The F-35 Lightning II is the world's most ambitious and technologically advanced fighter program representing a leap forward in modern military aviation. It's designed to serve not only the U.S. Air Force, Navy, and Marine Corps, but also a growing list of key allies around the world, uniting them under a single cutting-edge platform. With three distinct variants, F-35A, F-35B, and F-35C, this aircraft covers every mission profile, from conventional runways to aircraft carriers and even short, rugged airstrips, adapting to any operational need. Its true power lies in its revolutionary sensor suite and advanced data sharing capabilities. The F-35 absorbs, processes, and distributes battlefield information in real time, making every allied asset on the ground, sea, or air more effective and connected. It's a force multiplier, not just a fighter, amplifying the effectiveness of entire fleets and joint operations. The F-35's global user base from the US to Europe, Asia and beyond ensures seamless allied operations, interoperability, and a unified approach to modern threats. Stealth is paramount. Its carefully sculpted shape, radar absorbent materials, and internal weapons bays keep it hidden from enemy radar, allowing it to strike undetected and return safely. The distributed aperture system gives pilots a 360-degree view, projecting real-time data and threat information directly onto their helmet visors, enhancing awareness and survivability. This makes the F-35 a flying command center, prioritizing situational awareness and information dominance over sheer speed or maneuverability. Its innovative design, unmatched versatility, and global reach make it the backbone of Western air power for decades to come. The J-20 Mighty Dragon is China's answer to American stealth dominance, a leap from copying Soviet designs to fielding a homegrown top-tier stealth fighter. Built exclusively for the People's Liberation Army Air Force, the J-20 is a heavy twin-engine interceptor and precision strike platform. Its delta wing, canards and large internal weapons bay are optimized for speed, range and long-range missile engagements. The J-20's mission threaten high-value targets deep behind enemy lines and project power across the Western Pacific. China keeps the J-20's technology close, refusing to export it and focusing on regional superiority. Engine development has been a challenge but the new WS-15 engine promises supercruise and greater independence from foreign tech. As the J-20 matures it's becoming a formidable tool for China's military ambitions. Its presence signals China's intent to challenge U.S. air power in Asia, The F-35 and J-20 reflect two distinct philosophies. The F-35 is a versatile, single-engine jet designed for multi-role missions and seamless integration with allied forces. 
Its all-aspect stealth and sensor fusion make it a flying command node, prioritizing information dominance over raw speed. The J-20 by contrast, is a specialized twin-engine heavy fighter built for speed, range, and payload, optimized for long-range interception and strike. Its canards and large airframe favor aerodynamic performance, even if that means sacrificing some stealth from certain angles. The F-35 is a global project driving down costs through mass production and international collaboration. The J-20 is a national asset produced in smaller numbers for China's specific strategic needs. Each jet is a product of its nation's priorities, versatility and networking for the F-35, regional power projection for the J-20. Stealth is the defining trait of both jets, but the F-35's all-aspect design and radar absorbent materials give it a clear edge. Its single-engine and tight manufacturing tolerances minimize radar and infrared signatures from every angle. The J-20 Stealth is optimized for frontal engagements. Its canards and earlier engine nozzles create vulnerabilities from the sides and rear. The F-35's sensor fusion, combining radar, infrared, and electronic intelligence, gives pilots a god's-eye view of the battle space. The J-20 has advanced sensors, but its software integration and automation lag behind the F-35's mature systems. The F-35's helmet display and distributed aperture system allow pilots to see threats in all directions, a major combat advantage. The J-20's sensors are formidable, but its true edge will depend on future software and engine upgrades. In information warfare, the F-35 currently leads. Raw performance still matters in air combat. The J-20 with twin engines and a large airframe is faster, estimated at Mach 2, and is moving toward supercruise with the WS-15 engine. The F-35 tops out at Mach 1.6, lacking supercruise, a trade-off for stealth and cost. Both jets can operate at around 60,000 feet, giving them a high-altitude edge. The J-20's range is greater, designed for deep strikes across the vast Indo-Pacific. The F-35's combat radius is solid but it relies more on aerial refueling, making tankers a critical and vulnerable support asset. The J-20's canards and twin engines likely give it better climb and sustained turn rates. The F-35 is agile at low speeds and high angles, but not a pure dogfighter. In close combat, the J-20's kinematics could be decisive but the F-35 aims to avoid such fights with stealth and sensors. The F-35's greatest advantage is scale, over 1,000 delivered and counting with a global network of allied operators. This vast fleet is not just a number, it represents a powerful, interconnected force that can be rapidly deployed across the globe. The sheer presence of so many F-35S, supported by dozens of partner nations, creates a level of flexibility and resilience that is difficult to match. Mass production allows the US and its partners to field critical numbers across multiple theaters, sustaining operations in a prolonged conflict. The ability to quickly replace losses and surge reinforcements gives the F-35 coalition a significant edge in any drawn-out engagement, ensuring that air power remains constant and effective. China's J-20 fleet is smaller, about 250 to 300 jets, but concentrated in the Indo-Pacific, where local superiority matters most. By focusing its advanced fighters in a single region, China aims to achieve dominance in its immediate neighborhood, maximizing the impact of every aircraft. In a regional fight, China could deploy its entire J-20 force, backed by dense ground-based defenses. This combination of air and ground assets creates a formidable shield, making any incursion by adversaries a daunting challenge. The F-35 strength is multiplied by allied interoperability, US, Japanese, South Korean and Australian F-35S can operate as a unified force. This seamless cooperation allows for shared tactics, intelligence and logistics, making the whole greater than the sum of its parts. This allied network complicates China's planning and amplifies the F-35's impact. Coordinated strategies and real-time data sharing make it difficult for any adversary to predict or counter allied moves. The J-20's numbers are potent in a focused theater, but the F-35's global reach and partnerships are a unique force multiplier. The ability to project power far from home supported by allies gives the F-35 coalition a strategic advantage that extends well beyond raw numbers. The production race is not just US versus China, it's the F-35 global enterprise versus the J-20's regional concentration. 
this contrast shapes the balance of power, influencing both strategy and outcomes in any future conflict. The outcome will hinge on who best leverages their numbers and alliances. Success will depend not only on how many jets each side can field, but on how effectively they can coordinate, adapt, and sustain their forces under pressure. In modern warfare, quantity and quality are inseparable. The side that can combine both, and harness the power of partnerships, will shape the skies of tomorrow. The F-35 and J-20 are shaped by different trade-offs. The F-35's edge is its sensor fusion, networking, and all-aspect stealth, making it a battlefield intelligence hub. Its weaknesses, lower top speed, no super crews, and heavy reliance on complex logistics. The J-20 excels in speed, range, and payload built to threaten U.S. support assets like tankers and AWACS. Its weaknesses, less comprehensive stealth, especially from the sides and rear, and engine tech still catching up, the F-35 bets on information dominance and first-shot advantage. The J-20 bets on speed, reach, and the ability to strike critical targets. The better jet depends on the mission, pilot, and support network. Their strengths and weaknesses set the stage for a high-stakes strategic chess match. The F-35 and J-20 aren't just rivals, they're blueprints for the future of air combat. The F-35 embodies the Western model network, data-driven and coalition-ready. The J-20 is China's answer-specialized, high-performance, and integrated into a regional anti-access network. Future air battles will be won by the best network, not just the best jet. The F-35's edge is in allied integration and sensor fusion. The J-20's is in speed, range, and regional coordination. This arms race is accelerating advances in stealth, engines, and AI. The real contest may never be a direct dogfight, but a constant struggle for information and influence. How these jets evolve and integrate will define the balance of air power for years to come.